New teacher pipeline program is working so well that the Cab County School Board just approved a new university partner. Clayton State University will be helping train elementary school teachers for the district starting this summer. That's right. So 11 Alive's Christy Diaz, she took her camera inside of the classroom to shadow some of the first teachers to come out of the Ignite Teacher Residency Program. So today from musical theater major Malia Boyko Vea standing in front of a classroom of Southwest DeKalb High School students isn't all that different. Nerve wracking, you know, I I don't have as much stage fright because I've been in the stage. It kind of just feels the same, following a script, making sure like I know my lines, <laughs> just being prepared. This is a student teaching day, part of the rigorous Ignite Teacher Residency Program. She is part of the first cohort and will graduate in December, ready to teach English in her own classroom come January. This is the first one, so we're building the plane while we're flying it. You do feel like it's properly preparing you to be in the classroom on your own? Oh, definitely, yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So what do you have for the climate? For Cody Green, the perks of the program made it impossible to say no. It pays for a master's degree, offers a stipend, and provides hands-on training in the classroom four days a week. Yeah, every day I pick up something new that I'm using in the class. It can be intimidating at times, but I mean, they're kids. They're once you it, once you get their respect, it's it's no problem. What's the trick to getting a middle schoolers respect? Oh, uh, deep voice. The program is just as beneficial for the school system. Once the teachers are trained, the program requires them to stay and teach at one of the low-performing schools within the county. They're hurting for teachers, and this kind of creates a pipeline. They know, I mean, you're committed to DeKalb, right? Yep, five years. <laughs> I will be here until at least 2030. Igniting futures all around DeKalb County. Christy Diaz, 11 Alive News. Okay, so so far... The program is training three different types of teachers. The first group will teach 6th through 12th grade. The second will teach special education. And the third will teach elementary schools. The district is hoping to roll out a new co cohort of future teachers every six months.